good afternoon from a sunny afternoon here in La Peranda. Today the itinerary for me is to go and check out all the attractions here in the La Peranda city and I'm currently at Linnoitus which is the sand castles. So let's go check out what they have. That's not the castle yet. This is the castle. Where? Here yeah. are the walls. Huh? These are the castle walls. I guess. Okay, so I think I'm currently in the wrong place because this definitely is not the sand castle. This is like the remains of the castle. So it's like a fortress and there is a really nice lookout view where you're overseeing the lake. And Haba, so yeah, this is still a nice place to come and check it out. So, I think right now we are on the old town route. So, behind me, there's a La Perenda Art Museum, and then on this side, there is the church. Okay, so we have some explanation here. This location is called Linnoitos. Okay, so I was checking out that um, directory, but it's in Finnish. So there's another one. Let's see if it is in English. We are here at 21, which is the Commandant's house. This is where we are at. And if you look at it, there are like 57 places to check out here in this cluster which is a lot of places to go I'm coming over around the corner another night where I get so confused because we're just friends the friends who undress the friends with loose oh, we are here at the at the la Garialand Museo, so it is South Garelia Museum um, in La Peranda and apparently this is one of the best museums here in La Peranda as well so we are now gonna go check it out look how awesome these like buildings are it's like made of big stones it's like all around but let's go inside first and see how it looks Loose sands there kiss your neck and I don't mind if you waste my time Cause I've got some I can lose Act like I don't need your love And you call my bluff And that's all that I can ask of you museum so the exhibition is about Yalmari Lenkinen so he's like a very popular architect back in the 1930s so it's quite interesting to see how many buildings he have built and also the history about those buildings and his personal life so yeah I would recommend it if you have like some time to take a look around and also if you have the museum card of course and now we are gonna head towards the harbor because we want to check out the sand castles. Oh my god, by accident we found this Saima Geopark exhibition. So in case if you don't know, Saima is very famous for its um, national park where there is like a seal which has this ring um, pattern on his body and you can watch the movement of those seals live from a webcast apparently we are here at this exhibition where you can see all about the sea it wasn't even in my list but i'm pretty happy to come and explore this let's quickly go and check it out and 
so on. Yeah. About climate. And then there in the back corner, there's 25 minute film of how you see it on the moments in nature. Okay. And then the exhibition continues. There's some information about Simon Gale Park here. And in the back, there's exhibition with photos. Okay. Yes. Thank you. This board is created by the man called Sake and he had to catch all the fish and study them and draw them and paint them so it took him two years to complete this board which is pretty time consuming but the outcome is pretty awesome Calcium carbonate, mm. uh, kind of marble, calcium type of stones because mm. they were formed on ancient seas millions of years ago when little sea animals, very small, which had shell or structure that mm. included calcium, they died and they piled on the bottom of the sea millions of years. Then there was this collision where mountains formed and some of the sea that goes under inside the deeper on the ground. So deep there's hot and pressure mm. and then they Oh, so interesting. Yeah. So they are kind of not suitable for vegans yeah. <laughs> since they are formed from animal shell. Yes. <laughs> they like better than kiwi. Mm. It's 1.9. Um, 1,900 million years old. This is where you can find Saima Norpa, which is the seal. So we are currently around here, so there is no Saima seal. But the more you keep going north, then the more Norpa there are. Oh my god, I feel like that was one of the best museums ever I have visited here in Finland. I really love seeing all these bio marine um, items in there. Um, everything was super interesting. Um, there were also a lot of like information about the seals and also like fish, water animals. So I really recommend you to come and check it out if you're interested in it because this is such an amazing museum. So we are finally going towards the sand castle. So we 
we just left the park full of sand art the sand are like a replica of some of the games like Tamagotchi, Tetris and also even billiard so it's really interesting to see like how detailed they build those art and now we are just gonna go around the haba and see how the water here looks like it is really really calm it must be really nice to just like take your subboard and just paddle around that would be really nice activity to do so we are currently walking on the promenade along the haba i think this is pretty cool because even though there are many cities with harbors in Finland, I haven't really seen a proper promenade to walk on. I guess this is like a full mark when it comes to harbor here in La Palenta. such a sunny day I think the temperature is like 27 28 and we've been out the whole time and now I feel like my face is burning up but anyway um, we are now heading back towards the car um, I think we've seen pretty much um, all the main attractions here in La Parenta so we check out the whole Linodus area as well and a few uh, museum and we went to the sand art park and also we took a walk along the haba on the promenade i would say that it was a nice few hours to spend here in la perenta exploring the city and we are gonna head back home now to Helsinki. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you are watching this video, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, leave comment down below, and I'm gonna see you guys in my next one. Bye!